archery deer season opens in two weeks in D7 and actually in most of the D uh, zones. So I want to hunt close to home and I live in the Bass Lake area. There are a lot of areas here where I can hunt for deer and bear and I don't know most of this area. I always hunted Shaver Lake, Huntington, Kaiser Pass, all that area up there. And I don't want to drive an hour and a half or two hours if I don't have to. So if I find something to hunt here, I might even be able to hunt after work. That would be fantastic because I could have my bow in my truck. Um, I can just change at work and be up here by 4.30, maybe five and hunt. I couldn't do it with a gun, obviously, because I work at a school, but with archery, and that's how I'm going to hunt this year, um, that could work. This is just so amazing here. I'm by myself. There's absolutely no one around for probably miles and miles and I love it. It's just me and my dog. So I'm hoping to find some deer or signs of deer. I have my trail cam with me, so I'm going to put it up. I said I didn't know any of this area and someone on Facebook um, gave me away this spot I mean I didn't even know him and yet he messaged me and gave me all this wonderful information there are so many wonderful people out there so he told me to come to this campsite and this is pretty neat it's nice um, there are tables and fire rings and bathrooms and it's all free so it's perfect and you can hunt in this area directly and so that's what i'm going to discover and just um basically just venture out and see where i'm going to go um obviously i'm not going to tell you where this is because i don't want to give out his information so <laughs> my goal for this weekend and next weekend is to find some areas where i will be confident to go out opening morning and say okay this is what i'm going to hunt and not just then say okay well let's see how this will work Thank you. 
What the heck? Misha, I think it's gone. Oh my god, it's right there. Misha, leave it alone. Misha. Misha, off. Leave it alone. Look how cute. Misha, off. That's enough. That's enough. Let him be. Wow, I have... Misha, 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 come here. Off. Oh my god, that thing is hauling ass. <laughs> Misha, leave it alone. That was so weird. Oh my goodness. I didn't see any wildlife today. Um, no deer or bears or anything like that, which is okay, but um, I'm very comfortable with the area. And at least now I know the area and I was so surprised. There's water everywhere. And usually, um, there's no water. I mean, here we have flowing creek water all over the place. I used to hunt Shaver Lake mostly and, um, and the higher elevations, and it was hard to find water. Once you found it, you were golden, and here is just everywhere. So I can't emphasize how happy I am about that. This is definitely deer and bear territory, so just because I didn't see any, that doesn't mean, you know, they're not here. There's food, there's, there's shelter, there's habitat, there's everything. So, so tomorrow morning, I'm going to wake up early and drive around, hike around probably in some areas and, and see what I can see. And then I will have the rest of the day up until the early afternoon and then I'll go home. So this has been great. I am, I, I can't tell you how incredibly happy I am that I have found this campsite. There are other campsites around here. I, I talked to a few people who drove through here and everybody is so super nice. Just just really nice, great people. So I'm just going to relax a little bit, have dinner, um, get everything ready for the morning and then have a good night's sleep. The weather is absolutely perfect. Um, it's like in the high 60s, maybe low 70s in the sun. It's perfect and even at night. It's not cold yet and it's not hot. It's just perfect. So I really needed this weekend so badly for so long. And now I can do this more often. So this is where we are right now. probably hardly see it but that there is a bear cub that little thing in the middle I saw him and his mom just walking across the road they were both cinnamon and the mom was actually pretty small and I tried to record it and didn't do a, a good job but that was very very exciting I had a wonderful weekend I feel like a whole new world opened up to me I feel like I found outdoor paradise for real um, even though I haven't seen any deer and I have only seen that one mama bear and her cub which was a big deal um, and and I haven't actually figured out where I would be hunting or where I would even put my trail cam but I have discovered this whole area I've gone down on most of those roads and this is just amazing there's water everywhere which is unusual in the Central Valley. I mean, we're in a drought. It feels like we're always in a drought. And there's water all over the place. And there's food, there's shelter, there's just everything here. This is amazing. I will be coming here hunting and camping in the off season, fishing, swimming, just basically everything. So this is a weekend that I have been waiting for for a long time. Not just, you know, because of scouting, but um, but just to, to just relax and just really enjoy nature and, and camping itself. So I can't tell you how happy 
and excited I am right now. I probably should be naming this video the joys of camping <laughs> or something and not so much of like deer scouting but whatever. So basically this is it. Now I'm going to pack up and go home and tomorrow is Monday. School is starting. All is well. Everything is the way it should be. I'm back to camping, back to working. Life is great. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys next time.